Hello, my name's Dave White, and I'm going to be reading the first section of the Modernism article. So related terms are modern, modernist, contemporary, and postmodern. Modernism is a philosophical movement that, along with cultural trends and changes, arose from wide-scale and far-reaching transformations in Western society in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Among the factors that shaped modernism was the development of modern industrial societies and the rapid growth of cities, followed then by the horror of World War I. Modernism also rejected the certainty of Enlightenment thinking, and many modernists rejected religious belief. Modernism, in general, includes the activities and creations of those who felt the traditional forms of art, architecture, literature, religious faith, philosophy, social organisation and activities of daily life were becoming outdated in the new economic, social and political environment of an emerging, fully industrialised world. The poet Ezra Pound's 1934 injunction to make it new was the touchstone of the movement's approach towards what it saw as a now obsolete culture of the past. Nevertheless, its innovations like the stream of consciousness novel, 12-tone music and abstract art all had precursors in the 19th century. A notable characteristic of uh, modernism is self-consciousness which often led to experiments with form, along with the use of techniques that drew attention to the processes and materials used in creating a painting, poem, building, etc. Modernism explicitly rejected the ideology of realism and makes use of the works of the past by the employment of reprise, incorporation, rewriting, recapitulation, revision and parody. Some commentators define, define modernism as a socially progressive trend of thought that affirms the power of human beings to create, improve and reshape their environment with the aid of practical experimentation, scientific knowledge or technology. From this perspective, modernism encouraged the re-examination of every aspect of existence, from commerce to philosophy, with the goal of finding that which was holding back progress and replacing it with new ways of reaching the same end. Others focus on modernism as an aesthetic introspection. This facilitates consideration of specific reactions to the use of technology in the First World War and anti-technological and nihilistic aspects of the works of diverse thinkers and artists spanning the period from Friedrich Nietzsche, 1844 to 1900, to Samuel Beckett, 1906 to 1989. 